Hi, this is Gary Kay from Rave Publications again, and you're watching part two of a four-part series focusing on using consumer displays in commercial environments. Now, there's not a lot of applications I would suggest using com uh, consumer displays in commercial environments, but small meeting rooms, huddle rooms, um, brainstorming areas around buildings, and even some applications where you've got part-time digital signage, I think is fine. And of course, as I said in the last video, part one, I believe that the Samsung Smart TVs are the best consumer displays to use in that. Now, here's reason number one. All right, and that's what this video is going to focus on. This cable here comes free when you buy one of these Samsung Smart TVs through Almo Pro AV. Okay, and what this cable is is it has a nine-pin female connector on one end and a and a 3.5 millimeter jack on the other end. And basically, you plug this into the back of the Samsung display in a port labeled X-Link, 3.5 millimeter jack and it converts that into an RS-232 control capability. So the nine pin uh, uh, port is now a standard RS-232 port. So you can control all the functions discreetly to this monitor. So unlike an IR remote where you have the same power button turning a monitor on and turning it off and you're scrolling through inputs, in the case of RS-232, you'd be able to send a discrete on command, a discrete off command, an input three command. You'll, be able to, you'll also be able to do any sort of adjustments that you'd normally get from a from a remote control through RS-232. So that turns this consumer display into a commercial controllable display. So that's reason number one to, uh, to use Almo Pro AV and to consider using the Samsung uh, smart TVs in the case where you are gonna use a consumer display in a commercial environment. This is Gary Kay, keep watching because part three is gonna focus on apps.